Start cutting. Clem! Now you'll be burned alive and Clem with him. Why didn't Butch get Morgan out of there? Montana and that Parker girl. And don't come back without Clem Morgan alive. turned down a big deal. Dan Kirkland, who's extending the railroad from Auburn to Sycamore, wants me to supply the construction gang with beef. And you turned it down? Well, we failed the last time we tried to wrestle the Parker steers. So this time, we'll let Yontis make a cash deal with Parker. Then we'll go after the dough. Montana, I made a bet with Ann that I'd ride that horse within a week. And today is the last day. That's the Parker spirit, Mary. That's a mighty fine spirit, all right, but it never tamed a horse. That horse needs a lot of breaking. And you always want to use a hackamore on a green horse. 
Uh, get me one. Branded cattle is too tough to get rid of so close to home. So when Parker collects, I'll have Tex ride herd on the uh, Parker outfit and tip us off when they start driving the herd north. Yeah, it'll be much easier relieving Parker of the cash. Seeing that money doesn't carry a brand. Hey, Gil? You're right. Here's luck. I'll see you later. We're going to deliver about 500 head this first shipment. Where do you want them taken? Ed Yonder says there's an old deserted corral just before you hit over. That's where we're heading. You take some of the boys down the Laurel Range and round up the herd. All right. Dad, do you mind if Ed and I go along with them? Well, I guess that's all right. Hey, Montana? It's all right with me. Come on, man. extension is going to make us all rich. The line they're building right now runs from Auburn here into Sycamore. That roadbed is going to make our claims right valuable. Who's there? Come in. What's up, Tex? Montana and the Parker boys have started after the cattle. And there ain't nobody at the Parker Ranch now but old Jim Parker, Happy, and Clem Morgan. We'll ride to Auburn and meet them there. Seems to me this would be as good a time as any to grab Clem Morgan. You mean to rush the Parker Ranch while Montana and the cowpokes are riding herd? No, we won't rush them this time. We'll outsmart them. Now listen. The stagecoach heading for Clear Creek doesn't carry any passengers. So Jake, Pete, Butch, and Limpy will all ride the coach, while the rest of you hombres and some of my men will hide out at Devil's Pass. And then... cut out about 500 heads. Come on, get it. 
Here they come now. We got your man, boss. Good. I'll get in and ride with him. There's something I want to ask him. The rest of your mountain, ride along. You know where to go, Jake, so knock on it. can get us into more jams. You better head back for the ranch, Mary. Come on, gang. <laughs> 